lot of you have been asking me some good questions about this hub that I've been showing in my recent videos. So I decided to make a dedicated video answering those questions. The first question is, what is that gizmo that you've got attached to your iPad? Well, this is the 10 in one Acasis hub. It does everything that normal hubs do, but this is not just a normal hub. No, 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 you see? It's got this great little compartment here. I'll show you in this camera, it's a bit better. It basically transforms the hub into an SSD enclosure. And when you pair this with an NVMe SSD card, you can add up to eight terabytes of storage into this little thing. It does also support SATA SSDs. And you can expand a monitor at 4K60 refresh rate. All of a sudden, you've got this powerhouse in the size of your hands, right? With every port that you could ever need. Another question that I get a lot is, is this compatible with Windows devices? The answer is yes, you can use this with anything. A Windows PC, an Apple MacBook, an iPad, or even an Android tablet. And another question that I get is, how fast is it? Well, that depends primarily on the SSD card that you use. As it happens, I've got two different SSDs here at different price points and different performance as well. So I'll show you how they perform and the prices for each. But it also depends on the device that you're using. A lot of devices have been transitioning to USB-C for a long time, and Apple even are finally joining the party and focusing a lot more in Thunderbolt, which supports even faster speeds. Now, and before I get into the specs, let me just give you a practical example here. We'll do a normal synthetic test first, just to see. So we're getting about 800 meg on the synthetic on the read and write. The hub has been driving my monitor at 4K 60 Hertz. I'm just gonna take a temperature check. It's about 97 Fahrenheit, 36 Celsius. So it's pretty warm, but just driving the monitor. So we'll see after the data transfer, how hot it will get. All right, let's do a more realistic test now. We're gonna move 108 gig folder from my hub to my MacBook Pro and let's see how fast that goes. Okay, it's done 50 gigs now, just under a minute. So that wasn't too bad, exactly two minutes to transfer 108 gigs, so that's perfect. I'm just gonna take a temperature check now and see how hot it got. So it went up about 15 degrees, so it's 116 Fahrenheit now, which is about 46 degrees. So it did get a little bit warmer, but nothing too crazy. Acasis do provide a thermal pad. Let me show you here. It comes with a little sticker here, you can take it off. So it doesn't get dangerously hot, you know, it's made of aluminum as well, so it's naturally cool to the touch. As well as the USB-C main port that goes into your computer, it has this power delivery port as well, which means you only need one power cable going into this and from that to your laptop up to 100 watts as well. So even the beefier MacBook Pros these days will be fine with that. It has another USB-C port at 10 gig per second and two standard USB ports, one at 5 gig and another one at 10 gig. It has a couple of other slots supporting SD and micro SD cards. On the other side here, this is amazing, right? It has this full size HDMI capable of 4K at 60 Hertz and a gigabit ethernet port too. You know, that's a lot in one tiny device. As an example, with the SD and micro SD slots, you know, this makes an incredible tool for transferring photos, videos, or documents between devices. There's so much you can do here. I love to shoot raw photos these days and, and you know, later edit them in Adobe Lightroom. And with this device, what it means to me is, you know, that whole workflow, which used to be transferring cards, moving things from camera to laptop. Now it doesn't matter where I am, you know, or what device I'm using, whether I'm using the iPad Pro, the Tab S8 Ultra, the MacBook Pro, the process is the same. I don't need to format anything, it's just, just using this. The ports are in a perfect position too, so when you're using it, you know, it's very easy to set up and kind of hide it out of the way, so you can work in those tighter spaces or like, like a train or a cafe. It's quite small too, so you know, it will fit any bag really, or even in your pocket if you want to. This makes for a very convenient commute option, right? Or simply just going between client meetings or whatever it might be. They've just started recently on Kickstarter and they kind of blew up, you know, they became very popular very quickly. I'm a little late to the party here and I've been buying lots of other different hubs, but you know, I've been trying different things, but you know, better late than ever. I'm glad I finally found them. You know, shout out to Patrick and Almir as well who recommended them to me. Some products overcomplicate things. Let me just show you quickly because it's, it's driving me nuts that I haven't got this shot, look. In my pocket, absolutely no problem.
Acasis seem to have found a really good balance between looks, you know, looks great, and functionality. And they over delivered on that. You know, the convenience aspect is just fantastic. But that's not all. They also just launched this other enclosure here, you know, another aluminum casing. This one supports USB 4, which is even faster from an enclosure perspective. So if you don't need all these extra ports, but you like the extra external storage idea, this one is a rocket. Let me show you, this is even more compact as well. Now check this out. Oh, that's so satisfying. I will be reviewing this in the next video, so make sure you are subscribed so you know you don't miss out when I, when I review it. No screws, very easy to kind of just remove, upgrade the storage if you want to. Like I said, I'll be reviewing this. Yeah, so yeah, do subscribe and because when you do that, it really helps the whole YouTube algorithm thing, you know? They don't always put this video in front of the right audience unless you do those things, which I really appreciate. The benefit to you, you know, it's not just, not just to help me, right? Is that I'm here every week, at least on average, two videos a week now. I can't recommend this product enough. There will be links in the description for you. And there's so much more content over here in this playlist that I've done for you. And YouTube reckons that you're gonna like this one over here. I hope they're right. See you soon. I'm watching the rise, and I wouldn't say I'm shocked because I'm hardly surprised. This one's for the ride.